Okay, good morning, students. In a previous class, we are in sexual reproduction in flowering plant. We are now at the age of the end of the chapter that is the sexual reproduction in flowering plant. In that, in a previous class, we are discussed regarding the post fertilization events. Post fertilization events are nothing but double fertilization. Following from the double fertilization, development of a what we are going to call that as a development of embryo and zygote then uh, it is going to mature ovules are mature into the seeds and the ovary is mature into the fruit totally or collectively called as post fertilization events and in that we had discussed that yesterday regarding endosperm development of endosperm and uh, embryo and today we are going to go for study the conversion or the maturation of what ovules into the seeds and what ovary into the fruit. So now we will start discussing regarding the post fertilization success events in the seed. Seed, what is the seed? Seed is what the final product of the sexual reproduction. It is the final product of the sexual Reproduction. What is this? C is the final product of the sexual reproduction and is often described as fertilized ovule. C is a Non 
non aluminous or ex aluminous sieves are nothing but the sieves the sieves do not persist the endoscope sieves do not persist the endosperm what is that the sieves do not persist the sieves do not persist the endosperm in the sense the endosperm is completely completely choose during the what embryo development example i give you one is gram nut e is the reverse Okay, 
यार एंडोस्पर्म बनाए किस चीज़ ने अगर when the embryo is completely used the endosperm during embryonic development आप बोलते हैं अगर तो नंबर ना endosperm is completely used during the embryonic development ठीक है आप बोलते हैं अगर seeds नहीं हैं ना जब बात करना होगा seeds not versus the endosperm so I hope this is clear to you sir non albumin synthesis seeds not versus the endosperm albumin synthesis seeds versus some part of endosperm why like this because the endosperm is completely used during the embryonic development and here the endosperm do not use completely during the embryonic development so these these are the two things we you are going to remember another one important thing you are going to remember here in some examples like what we are going to call black paper example black paper and black paper and beach example like what i told you black paper black paper and beach here what is going to happen they are going to process black paper and beach in this seeds seeds Versus some part of new cells, they are versus some part of new cells. Okay, is called as periscope. It's called as periscope. What I told you. In some cells, there is persistence. All right. In some cells, persistence. Yeah, it's a S K. Yeah, it's a S K. Persistence means what? You do what you do. Okay. Right. This is about what few definitions regarding the cells. What are the things I told you now? Seed. It is a final product of a sexual reproduction. Seed. It is described as fertilized ovum. The part of the seeds. Seed core. Forty rounds. Embryonic axis. Embryonic axis is a simple structure and it is solar due to the presence of reservoir pool material. Types of seeds in the sense non-albuminous or ex-albuminous seeds and albuminous seeds. Non-albuminous or ex-albuminous seeds in the sense seeds do not process endosperm. Ah, uh, seeds may endosperm in a way, albuminous seeds in a way endosperm in a way. And another one thing in an example of a black pepper and B, the seeds process some part of endosperm is called as So all these are one last question. What are albumin seeds, non-albumin seeds, then parts of the seeds? What is seed? These are all one last question. And I hope this is clear to you people. This is clear to you people, right? Now we will move towards the next thing. What is the next thing we are going to go for now? Whatever. We are going to get the integuments of the what ovule. Integuments of the ovule. Those integuments of the ovule are harder as a tough protective seed coat. In the sense, whatever seed coat is nothing but wall. The what we are going to call as a harder integuments. And make tough coat. That is what seed coat. Seed coat is nothing but what? Whatever the integuments are there. Integuments are there. No matter what we call it. Suppose this is an embryo, and here a brown hair. Okay. So these are. Integuments and these integuments are going to form a seed. I integument them under seed coat. Another whatever we are finding here, microphyla core here, a small core is going to remain in a what we are going to call that as a seed. A remain in a seed and that is provide the oxygen for the germination. 
hole or a small hole is going to remain that is going to provide what the oxygen and water facilitate the oxygen or water during the seed germination okay now what is going to happen after this you will add the seed coat i do seed i do then what is going to happen the seed is going to go for maturation in the sense when the seed is going to mature once the seed is going to mature the water content is reduced In the sense, right. When the seed is going to mature, the water content, the water content is going to reduce. Water content is going to reduce, and seed become dry. And seed become dry. Understood? And generally, it slow down the maturity. See, slow down is. metabolic activity slow down its metabolic activity seed is going to slow down its metabolic activity and the embryo may enter the state of inactivity now then what is going to happen embryo of the seed enters into the into the inactive stage is called as dormancy it's called as dormancy this is a so very important dormancy one mask question kata d o r m e n c y dormancy is that again what is going to happen once the seed start getting mature at the maturity of the seed The water contents are water contents in the seed is going to reduce the sense seed is going to dry. You can learn about the thing about the thing. You know, hashi is the thing. One bees, na. A bee ka hashi is that na one step. One step is that na. A bee is that na. Na step is that na. Dry is that na. A bee is that na. Dry is that na. Dry is that na. Na step is that na. Dry is that na. Na seed slow down its metabolic activity. A seed that na metabolic activity na slow down one thing. For example, na na germination na bodo atwa respiration na bodo atwa it may be. आवा मेटा वाले कैटेगरी में ना करेंगे मार्ग इन द सेंस आगे ना कैटेगरी पास में आ गया एम्ब्रियो ऑफ द सीड एंटर्स इनटू द इनएक्टिव स्टेट एम्ब्रियो ऑफ द सीड एम्ब्रियो ऑफ द सीड एंटर्स इनटू द इनएक्टिव स्टेज दैट इज कॉल्ड एज ए डॉर्मेंसी दैट इज कॉल्ड एज ए डॉर्मेंसी सो इन डॉर्मेंसी दे एंटर आ तो बिकट होगी अथवा इन डॉर्मेंसी दा होत अंदर ये ना कैटेगरी पास में आ गया फॉर लॉन्गर टाइम वी आर गोइंग टू स्टोर दीस And we can use those seeds as a food, and also we are going to use those seeds for the next generation. And then I am talking about that. Matter now, next production can be used for. Okay. And now what is going to happen after this dormant seed? When the dormant seed is going to break? When the dormant seed is break? If suitable conditions like सुटेबल कंडीशन वाटर ह्यूमिडिटी ऑक्सीजन आर अवेलेबल देन सीरीज स्टार्स जर्नी स्टार्ट so these things you are going to remember these things you are going to remember regarding what we are going to follow that one as a see so what else we are studying in see first i told you see see it is a final part of the sexual reproduction then see is also described as fertilizer ovule then i told you see for embryo embryo of embryo axis and the pottery of There are the two types of seeds: albuminous, non-albuminous, and in some seeds there is a uh, persist of some mucilus. They are going to call it as a perisperm. Okay, that we are going to call as a perisperm, and 
then I am going to when the seed is mature that time the water content the seed is going to lose its water content in the sense dehydration and it is become a dry and that time the seed slow down its uh, metabolic activity that is the thing when the embryo of the seed is entered into the inactive stage is called as a dormant seed and when the dormant seed is going to break when the seed can suitable conditions like water humidity oxygen now we are going to discuss about the seed and start germinating so this is about what the seed now we are going to go for the next point that is the fruit that will be for next point that is fruit or right. before that i am going to draw diagram for type of the this much is to draw the diagram and now here this 
This is premium. This is a medical. This is polio rhinza. This is polio type. This is cutellum. In the sense, cotillon. That is cutellum. I told you.